Hey Railheads, how would you like to have a couple lighted vending machines on your layout? I'll show you how I made mine, coming up on my Finger Lakes Railway layout. Well, I wanted to add a couple lighted vending machines to my layout, but I couldn't find any. So I decided to scratch build some. And it was a pretty easy build. I just made a box out of 20 thou plane styrene. And now I used the Woodland Scenics just plugged lighting system on my layout, and I had some extra LED nano lights and light hubs. But if you don't already have a lighting system, then you'll need to either invest in the just plug system or come up with another method. I'm painting the back and the sides, inside and out, a dark color. I'll leave the front unpainted so the light can shine through better. I used a number 46 drill bit to drill the hole in the bottom for the light to go in. I snagged some photos online and resized them for HO scale, and I'll put a link in the description to those files in case you want to use them, and that'll save you having to resize them. Now when you go to print, make sure you choose actual size. So I just printed mine in normal resolution on regular printer paper as a test, but they look fine, so I went ahead and used them. I think the light would shine through regular paper better than photo paper anyway. I wanted to see if this idea even had a chance of working before I went too far with it. Oh yeah, looks good. Just going to need another coat or two of dark paint. See here, because my hands are in the way, but I'm using a dab of gel CA where the wires enter the bottom of the machine to hold the light in place. I used matte medium to glue the machines down onto my layout. And I'm using the same CA again here to glue the printouts to the styrene. And just a couple tiny dots is all you need. Another one that's hard to see, but I'm cementing the top of the machine now with mech. I sanded all the joints flush after the cement set up. I had a little gap on one where the roof didn't fit just right. Some black electrical tape fixed that. If the tops of your machines will be visible on your layout, you'll need to take some extra care to prevent the light bleeding through because the bare bulb faces the top of the machine. You can't see the tops of mine. They're hidden by the overhanging metal roof. Well, this was a lot easier than I thought it would be. I hope you'll give it a try. I bet they'd look cool in a building interior, too. Hey, thanks for watching. See you next time on my Finger Lakes Railway Layout.